Hi, I'm Corey, and today I'm going to show you how to write advanced variable rate seed prescriptions. The first thing you want to do is log into your account on climate.com and select the field you want to write the seed prescription for from your list of fields on the left of the screen. Then, click on the Prescriptions tab at the top left of the screen. From the Prescriptions screen, you're going to choose Planting. If you've already created a seed prescription, you'll see it here. To create a new seed prescription, click Create New Prescription. Advanced seed prescriptions can currently be written for corn only. So, from this screen, click on Start next to Advanced Seed Prescriptions to get started. This next screen provides the ability to deselect yield or imagery data from specific years. This historical data enables our scientific model to get a clearer picture of your field's performance across time, so FieldView can provide you with the most effective and accurate prescription. However, there may have been a year that was an anomaly, or inaccurate historical data was captured for that year. In those cases, you probably want to deselect. This is not a necessary step to create your prescription, so if you decide all data looks good, move on to the next step by clicking Next. Please note, in order to create an advanced seed prescription using historical yield data, the field must have two years of yield data, one of which must be corn. In order to create an advanced seed prescription with imagery, you must have a field in a region where three years of historical imagery is available. One of those years must be identified as a corn crop. On this screen, you'll need to plug in your inputs for your seed's prescription including planting date, hybrid, target yield, seed cost, and your grain price per acre, then click Next. Based on your historical field data and the data you entered, your zones will automatically populate with our recommendation for your seed prescription. From this screen, you have the ability to make adjustments to your prescription. Maybe you want to kick up your yield estimate a bit. You can do this by using the slide bar at the top right. Slide the button to the right to see how that affects your population, number of bags of seed needed, cost, projected yield, and revenue. Or maybe you want to lower your investment a bit. You can do this by sliding the bar to the left. Again, you will see how it affects your population, number of bags of seed needed, cost, projected yield, and revenue. When you're feeling good about your choices, click Finish in Editor. On this final screen, you can make final adjustments to yield and population by zone, merge zones, split zone, or draw a new zone. For example, if you decide to run a test strip, you could draw a zone for that. When finished, click Save. This prescription will automatically be sent to the FieldView Cab app for execution in your field. Or, by tapping Export, you can send the prescription to John Deere or download it. It's that easy. The prescription's all set to go when you're ready to start planting with your equipment of choice. I hope you found this video helpful. If you need additional assistance with your advanced seed prescriptions, please contact our support team at 1-888-924-7475. Feel free to leave a comment with questions you'd like covered in the next series, and be sure to subscribe to our channel to see how other farmers are optimizing their yields with FieldView. Other videos in this playlist feature answers to frequently asked questions like, how do I upload my data? Or, how do I install my FieldView drive? Subscribe to our channel to get notifications of new videos. Thanks for watching.